Crumpus, what are you doing in my video? It's not your turn. Get out of here. Sorry about that, everybody. Brandon Rowe here. Today, we're going to listen to some music, we're going to draw, and we're going to have a good day. Two. A one, two, three, four. <laughs> So, before we get started, we're going to need a few things. A space to write on, some paper, uh, some colors, lots and lots of colors. Now, a couple things before we start. First of all, don't worry if you don't have a lot of colored pencils or markers. Just use what you got. Even if you only have a pen or pencil, our imagination will do the rest. So now that we're almost ready to go, I'll tell you what we're going to do. In this next part of the video, we're going to listen to three different pieces of music. While we're listening, we're going to think about the music and draw whatever comes to mind. I say we because while you're listening and drawing, I too will be doing the same thing. Keep drawing until the music stops. If you didn't finish your drawing, that's okay. If you want to go on to the next piece of music, that's fine. But if you really want to finish your drawing, go ahead and pause the video and then continue when you're ready. Before we begin, I'm just warning you now, I'm in no way an artist. I apologize now to any first or second graders that might cry from watching this. Third, fourth, and fifth graders, don't get angry with me when you see me in the streets. And to my future children, don't take me off your ofrenda. Like I said before, draw whatever comes to mind. Even if you only draw lines and dots, that's okay. Whatever the music is saying to you and your marker, go for it. Last thing, while the music is playing, you don't have to look at the screen. I'm going to be there so that you have a friend to draw with. And just in case you need some help or need some inspiration. I'm not going to talk too much because I really want you to listen to the music and think about things like, how does this make me feel? What colors am I seeing? What does this remind me of? What does this music smell like? What food does this music taste like? So with all of this in mind, let's listen to some music and draw. Viva la musica! life. Wow, this is pretty nice. I'm talking about the music. Is it me, or does the music sound different? What are you hearing? How are you feeling? I kind of feel happy and safe? I don't know, I just kind of want ice cream now.
works. I feel so frustrated. Sorry. I didn't mean to yell. I think I got caught up in the music. It was really intense again. gonna lie that ending was pretty cool i think i'm gonna finish my drawing hope you don't mind so i'm just about finished and before i'm done though i'm curious did you like the piece of music were you happy were you sad or were you happy and sad if you were wondering yes those black specks are my bumblebees, and one of them is eating my ice cream that I dropped. Oh, can't forget the signature. Make sure you sign your artwork or put your name on it. Be proud of your creation. If you think you're done, go ahead and continue on. If you still want to draw, go ahead. You can either pause the video or rewind the video and listen to the piece again. When you're done, continue to the next part. See you soon. friend. Glad you're finished with your first drawing. I think this next one's gonna be pretty cool. Why, you ask? Well, in the last piece, all we heard was piano. So far, what do, have you heard any piano? How to feel about this one. It's not intense like the last one, and it's not super energetic either. To me, two words come to mind. Pretty and lazy. You know what else is pretty and lazy? Moo Moo and Humphrey, my two rabbits. <laughs> anyway, what adjectives would you use to describe the music? Is there someone or something that you're thinking of while listening to the music? Oof, yikes. I'm gonna need a minute to finish. You probably need some time too. Go ahead and pause the video to finish up or rewind to the beginning of the piece again so you're able to go 
get another listen. See you when you're done. Hey friend, hope your drawing came out the way you wanted it to. I was trying to draw a grassy swamp, but then my green colored pencil decided to just go to sleep on me, so I had to change my plan and use the green marker instead. Have you ever been in a situation where you planned something or thought something was going to happen, but out of nowhere, everything just changes? Before we listen to our last piece, I was wondering, do you know how many instruments there were in that piece? In the first piece, this was an easy question, but it was just piano. But there wasn't a, any piano in the second one, so how many instruments were there? And I guess we can also ask, what instruments were there? I'll give you a hint. Quintet. If you still haven't finished, that's okay. It's your choice if you want to draw or continue on to the last piece of music. See you there! So before we begin this last one, I just want to let you know that it sounds very different compared to the last two. While you're listening and drawing, think about the instruments you've heard before and hear if they are in this piece. Also, between you and me, this isn't one of my favorite pieces of music and I kind of don't like it that much, but that's okay. And if you don't like it, that's okay too. But if you don't like it, think about why you didn't like it. How does it make you feel? Does this music taste weird? Have fun. I'm gonna cover this guy up. I don't like how my friend is looking at me.
I think if I saw this hammer at Home Depot, I would ask myself, is this even a hammer? You know those little clicking sounds that we heard throughout that piece? It reminded me of tap dancing. And tap dancing reminds me of Mary Poppins, so I'm drawing an umbrella for Mary Poppins. Anyway, I told you that this piece of music was different, but to be honest, I started to actually like it. It had a really hypnotizing groove. What did you think? Would you recommend this to a friend or a family member? Besides this video, where would you hear this song? At the mall? At a birthday party? At a soccer game? If you like this piece of music, you're welcome. And if you didn't, you're welcome. For those of you who didn't like it, that's okay. Because as people, we all like different things and we all dislike different things. As you grow up, whether it's music, food, or certain subjects in school, we discover our likes and dislikes th through our everyday experiences. Having different likes and dislikes is what makes us people. Speaking of people, all three of the pieces of music were composed by women. The first one was by Clara Schumann. The second one was by Amy Beach. And the last one was by Julia Wolf. If you still haven't finished your drawing, that's okay. It's your choice if you want to keep drawing or take a nap after this video. But before you go, two things. Share your drawing with the people you live with. Those people usually like when you share your experiences with them. And finally, don't forget to sign your creation. This is Brandon Rowe signing off. <laughs> see, did you, got, did you all see what I did there? I said signing off and oh, we were talking about signing. Thanks for joining me today. Have a good day.